the advanced driver assistance systems, including cruise control, can be activated via buttons located on the steering wheel. The layout of these buttons depends on how your BMW is equipped. For models with standard equipment, your layout will look like this. When the limit function is set, the car will not accelerate past the set speed unless there's extensive throttle input initiated by the driver. Press this button to turn the dynamic cruise control on or off. To set your current speed, press the set button. The rocker switch allows you to increase or decrease the set speed by one and five mile per hour increments. If equipped with speed limit assist, when activated, the system will recognize when the speed limit has changed and will propose the new set speed. To accept, press the set button. You can temporarily deactivate the cruise control by pressing the cancel button or by applying the brakes. To return to cruising at your set speed, press the resume or res button. To turn off the system, press the dynamic cruise control button again. Models equipped with active cruise control with stop and go will have different buttons for these additional features. Here, this button activates the system. Once set, active cruise control allows the driver to set a desired following distance from the vehicle traveling in front and adjust the vehicle speed to maintain the preset following distance and will even bring the vehicle to a stop. Use this button to increase the follow distance and this one to decrease it. To turn off the system, press this button again. In models with Active Driving Assistant Pro, the Assist button is used to turn the steering and traffic jam assistant feature on and off. In addition to all of the previously mentioned features, it has a Mode button for selecting between driver assistance profiles. By pressing the Mode button, the vehicle will cycle between either distance control or assisted driving, which includes steering control. There is also an LED above both the left and right control pads on the steering wheel. The two LEDs provide additional visual indicators. When green, the assistance system is active. If it turns yellow, interruption of the assistance system is pending. And when it shows red, the assistance system has been deactivated and you should take over driving. In models with the extended traffic jam assistant, the traffic jam assistant is further enhanced when certain conditions are met. When prompted to activate, press the mode button. The system uses a camera to ensure the driver is looking at the road and paying attention to their surroundings, allowing for an even more comfortable drive by removing the requirement to hold the steering wheel. To turn off the driving assistant, just press the assist button. For more information on any of these advanced driving assistance systems, please consult your owner's manual or your BMW Genius.